Hi again, everyone. So I thought I would come on today and show you what I received in my um, May Birch Box and my May Beauty Fix. And then I also thought I would show you what I got in the May um, Pop Sugar Must Have Mini Box that I recently subscribed to. Actually, last month was their first month, so this is my second box. So let me just sh start by showing you what came in this month's Birch Box. And normally I like to pick the box that I already know what's coming, but I saw the email too late this time. Um, so I just think I picked a sample is what I did. I picked a sample and then they picked everything else. And I already looked at everything and I think it's a pretty good box. Birch Box is $10. If you go on their website and you review the products that you receive, you get points. And the points equal out to be like $5 back. So technically it's kind of $5 a box if you do the reviews. And I'm not very good about doing the reviews, so. But I figure for $10, um, it's fun to try new things. And I, I've found a few things through Birch Box that I don't think I would have found otherwise. So let me show you really quick um, what was in my box. They always send you a little card letting you know about your products. And the sample that I chose to receive was by Real Chemistry, and it's the Luminous 3-Minute Peel, and I think it's for your body. I actually do like this product. I'm using it right now, but I have the one that's for your face, not for your body. So I thought I would give the body one a try. Um, and I do, it's what I'm using right now, actually. I finished using that Ole Henriksen Lemon Strip Flash Peel, and so now I'm using my Real Chemistry 3-Minute um, peel for my face and I really it, it's good um, I wish it was longer than three minutes that's the one thing I liked about the Ole Henriksen you would put it on it's like a gel and you leave it on for like 10 minutes I just feel like it works a little bit better um, I think that the real chemistry one is good for just kind of like a little bit of upkeep but not like a deep type peel if that makes sense but I wanted to try the body peel and it says um, it's like an exhilarating grapefruit so that sounds good and I don't know if there's enough in here for your entire body though. Like it looks like a lot in this packaging. The packaging is big, but it's pretty flat. So that's the only thing that kind of concerns me is um, will it be enough for your whole body? But maybe you pick an area that you want to exfoliate. That would make sense. Cause it looks like they have like a diagram back here. So maybe that's the deal. Maybe you just use it like on your elbows or on your knees or something like that. So when I have my reading glasses, I'll look at the back of this. But it says, um, yeah, this acid-free peel gently exfoliates for instantly softer, smoother, brighter skin. And a full size of this would be $34. So, we got that. And then we also got, or we, I also got from Ico, I think that's how you pronounce it, Ico London, a mini liquid eyeliner in black. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to pass this on to my daughter. Um, I rarely use liquid eyeliner. Um, I do occasionally, but I usually use it in brown. Uh, this would probably be maybe good for doing like a wing or something, which I have never mastered. So my daughter you likes the liquid, so I will give that to her. So that's cool. And the full size of the eyeliner would be $16. So then I also received from Oblifica. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, Oblifica. It is a Seaberry hair serum. For fine to medium um, hair, it looks like. Well, the last thing I really need is any more hair serums, to be honest with you. So I'm not super excited about this, but let's see what it says. It says, antioxidant rich sea buckthorn berry, the anchor of this lightweight serum, helps to treat and repair dry damaged hair. I don't really think I have dry damaged hair either. I don't have the softest hair, but when I was lightening it, it definitely was much more damaged and dry. Um, now I just kind of color it to kind of keep it my natural hair color. So uh, I might I might just swap this out, like on my subscription addiction or something. But it's a nice size sample. Okay, and then also from Kula, we've got a makeup setting spray. It says green tea and aloe. So that's kind of nice. A nice deluxe size sample of that. I think I've gotten this before, actually. I might have passed it on to my daughter. I can't remember. Um, it's weightless matte finish mist that sets your look, hydrates skin, and blocks UV rays. This will be good for summer, so that's nice because it does have uh, SPF 30, it looks like, in it. So um, 
I will be definitely trying this out using that. And then the last thing in here um, is by Cartier. Okay, there's no way I can pronounce this. Liz Rose, okay. Something that I can't pronounce, but it's a perfume sample on the little card. And like I've said before, I do like the perfume samples with the sprayer because otherwise it's just too hard to use when it's just the vial and it has a little stick in it. I don't like those, but the sprayer ones are cool. And let's see what it says about that. It says, this sweet, subtle scent comes from a captivating cocktail of crystallized pink lily petals and hints of raspberry. Okay, that sounds right up my alley. It sounds kind of sweet, and I love sweet things. And the full size of that retails for $64 to $90, obviously, depending on what size you get. Okay, well, that's that was what was in my birch box, and for $10, I think it was great. Uh, perfume sample. I'm really looking forward to trying the body peel. Setting spray, which has an SPF in it, which is perfect for summer. The eyeliner, liquid eyeliner, that I'm going to pass on to my daughter. And then the hair serum, which I'm kind of indifferent about. But still, overall for 10 bucks, I feel like Birchbox, I mean, I think it's a great deal for 10 bucks, and I have not been disappointed in Birchbox for quite a while. So definitely a subscription box that I will be keeping. Okay, now I will show you what came in my Beauty Fix, which is um, from the Derm Store. And I think I've told you guys all this before. I signed up for a subscription for it's like, so it's like $24.95 or $24.99 a month plus a couple dollars tax, but the shipping is free. You can buy this box one time, and I think it's like $34.95 or $34.99, probably plus tax. All right, and I've already looked to see what's in here, so I'll go ahead and show you. Okay. So the first thing is by Beauty Blender, and it's a little tiny micro mini Beauty Blender. Can you see it? Mine fell out of the little holder. But isn't that cute? It's actually for like applying, I think, concealer. Is that what it said? It's really cute. Um, it says, yes, forget all other makeup sponges. Now this 21st century micro makeup applicator delivers laser focused concealing, contouring, and highlighting for face and eyes. 100% latex free. Okay, I don't know. I mean, I guess, yeah, it would work for contour, but I don't have any cream contour. I only have the powder. But I can definitely see this using for concealer which technically I don't really use very often because I find that it sits in my fine lines. But highlighter, I've got that YSL, um, it was kind of in the pink shade. Uh, this would be perfect for that. I've been kind of bl blending it in with like a brush, but I think that, the, that this applicator would be much better to try to blend it in. I've been putting it kind of like right here, a little bit like right here, and then some on my chin and a little bit right here. And it really does brighten and give you a really nice bright like not over the top look. I've really been enjoying it. Remember I had gotten that in an influencer like what maybe a month ago or something. I've really been enjoying it actually and I'm so thankful that they let me try that for free. So anyways that was the first thing we got and um, of course I didn't write down retail value but I'm guessing maybe like I don't know eight or nine dollars. I don't know. I know the full size is like I want to say it's around $19.99 so yeah I would guess that this would have to at least be half that. Okay so that was awesome. And then we also received from Dr. Babor, Babor, I'm not really sure. Um, it's full size. It is a dermacellular collagen booster cream, which I'm excited to try this. I love trying new skincare products. I just totally love it. So let's see if I can find it on here. Oh yes, it says, youth restoration you can see and feel. This innovative revitalizing cream boosts elasticity which is what I really need help with, and luxuriously hydrates, giving skin a plump, youthful experience. I'm really excited to try this. Um, I can't, I don't know if it's like a day cream or a night cream, so I need to do a little more research. I'm kind of hoping, well, it doesn't really matter because I'm almost out of both, so I will definitely be putting this to use, and I'm super excited. I have not looked to see what this retails at, but I'm guessing that just the price of this alone covered the entire cost of the box, but I'm only guessing. Okay, and then we also received from Replenix Pure Hydration Hy Hyaluronic, I have such a hard time with that word, Hyaluronic Acid Serum. And I do love serums, and this is a really nice kind of, I would call that like a deluxe sample size. I don't think that's full size at all, but it's a really nice size. It has like a dropper, I think that's cool. It says, this intensely hydrating serum, okay, my dogs just came in from outside. Hold on, Bailey. 
This intensely hydrating serum quenches skin with its weightless hyaluronic acid formula. Softens lines, boosts collagen. Hold on. Um, it boosts po One second. Okay, this is pathetic that I have to bribe my dog with a bone so that I can have a little peace and quiet. Don't do like I do. Stick to your guns. Okay, where was I? Okay, yes, this intensely hydrating serum quenches skin with the weightless hyaluronic acid formula, softens lines, maybe around here, I don't know, boosts collagen production and increase antioxidant benefits in one step. So I'm looking forward to trying that. Right now I've been using, um, I ran out of, which I may have mentioned, my vitamin C that I really like from Colleen Rothschild. I don't know, I'm looking there, I'm looking there, I don't know where to look. But anyways, I've been using a serum from uh, Palmetto, I think is what it's called. It came in one of my subscription boxes. And so once I finish that, then I can try and use that, that serum. So I'm looking forward to that. Okay, and then we also got from Glow Therapeutics, which I've not heard of before. It's a vital eye cream. Eyeless Vitamin E Evening Primrose. Okay, so this must be what's in it. Eyeless, which I don't know what that is. Vitamin E and Evening Primrose Oil. So it's an eye cream. And I don't know if that's, I mean, I bet that's full size. It looks like it would be because, you know, eye creams don't come in huge tubes. So it, this says, it's like a dose of vitality for your delicate eye area. This replenishing eye cream helps diminish dark circles and puffiness, which luckily I don't have a problem with dark circles. And I don't really think I have a problem with puffiness either, but I do have fine lines. While restoring lost moisture with its unique eyeless technology. Well, it doesn't talk about fine lines, but hoping, you know, I'm hoping that that would address that. Um, I'm using one by Colleen Rothschild right now that I really, really like. It's been my fa favorite eye cream I've ever used, believe it or not. So once I'm done with that, I wanted to order another one, but I might give this a try. Okay, and then from Avene, is that how you pronounce that, Avene? It's an SPF 50, and it's a mineral ultra light hydrating sunscreen lotion. I'm very excited about this, very excited about this. Because summer's coming and I do wear sunscreen on my face. Now I do know that a lot of my, um, like most of my foundations do have an SPF in them, but not very much, like maybe 15, maybe 20. So I definitely am looking forward to using, especially if we go on vacation somewhere hot and sunny, it's really important to protect your face, believe me. Um, I do have a lot of sun damage. Uh, you can see, well, maybe you can't. I've got a bunch of sunspots coming here. My shoulders are horrible. I definitely didn't wear sunscreen when I was younger like I should have, and I'm trying to do so now. But this is also an awesome, awesome product I'm excited about trying. So I've had so many great products in this box. This, I, I think I've met, I mean, I know I've said it. I love the Beauty Fix um, subscription. I think it's the best bang for your buck that I found out there. So it says, ideal for sensitive skin types. This chemical-free, which I think is also cool, mineral-based sunscreen repels UV rays while also shielding skin from environmental environmental damage, and premature aging. So I just think this is so awesome. I wonder if we should open it. We should open it. Yeah, that's nice. Comes like this. Oh, and there's the, um, you see what the applicator or tip looks like? That's awesome. I'm super excited about this. Beauty Fix, this was a great box. I'm really happy. Okay, and we're, two more things. And then these are kind of really small things. This is by La Roche Passe, and it's like a deluxe sample. It doesn't look like there's much there. What is this? This is it's got a broad spectrum SPF of 60. Okay, this is another sunscreen, an ultra light sunscreen fluid, fast absorbing matte finish for normal to combination skin. Okay, that's cool. So, you know, now we've got a second little one to try. Now this probably wouldn't last for very long. It's like a small tube, but that's okay. So it says, it not only gives broad spectrum protection to ward off damaging wrinkle cause and UV rays, but this advanced sunscreen also leaves a light matte finish that feels great under makeup. Well, that's, that's cool because I would be putting it under my makeup. So I'm gonna try that, SPF 60, that's pretty good. And then the last thing is from Skin Medica, which their products I believe are pretty pricey. I don't think I've ever had anything from Skin Medica though that I've actually purchased. Um, this is HA5, it's pretty small. It's, um, it's an HA5 rejuvenating hydrator. With its blend of five types of hydrators, this softening serum 
plumps up skin to reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles while vitamins protect skin from free radicals. Okay, so I am assuming that this is like a serum that you put underneath your moisturizer. So I'm looking forward to trying this as well. That sounds really good. All right, that was everything in my beauty fix. But again, I thought that was a fantastic box for 24. I think it is $24.95, um, obviously plus a couple bucks shipping. So I'm very, very happy with that, very happy. Okay, and then lastly, I'll show you really quick, what are we at, 15 minutes? I will show you what came in my Pop Sugar mini must-have. Now, this is a new box from Pop Sugar. I used to get the full-size box, but I just felt like, I don't know, like I wasn't super blown away with the boxes, and I had been getting it for a really long time, and then stuff just kind of sat around, like I didn't know what to do with it, because some of it is great for gifts, some of it is, is usable, but I'm just, I just felt like I was turning into a hoarder with all the stuff I was getting, so when I saw that they had a mini box, I was really interested in it. And I do occasionally miss getting the Pop Sugar box, I'm gonna be honest. So I thought I would try the mini. Now I have to be honest, last month, last month's was okay. I mean, I wasn't blown away. I was kind of thinking with it being their first box that they would, I didn't, I didn't do a video, I don't think. If I did do a video on it, I'm sorry, because now I'm repeating myself. But I we received a candle. It was kind of a small candle. Actually, hold on. I have it right here because I haven't burned it yet. So it was um, White Melon by Green Market Purveying Company or something. I mean, it's really cute. Don't get me wrong. It's cute. And it actually smells good. I mean, it smells like like melon, like cantaloupe. I think I, I, think I might have done a review on this because didn't I say I wasn't sure if my husband would like that? Okay, so I guess I already talked about it. I'm sure I must have. Anyways, we got the candle. We got the lip balm. But um, I just wasn't really blown away, but I didn't want to cancel, although I read a lot of stuff online people were canceling, but I thought, no, I'm going to stick it out. It's like $18.99, I think, a month. So then we got this month. This month, I actually think, is kind of worse than last month, if, I, if I'm being honest. Um, I'm still not going to cancel. I'm just weird like that. I just keep thinking it's going to get better and better, so I'm going to give it a few more months. It's just how I am. So there's two items again. I kind of wish they would do three items. I know it's only $18.99, but even if it was something real cheap, I shouldn't say cheap, but you know what I mean, three items would be good. Maybe even like a little candy bar or something. I don't know. That would be nice. So if you're watching Pop Sugar Mini, maybe just something else a little. But we got a H2O Beauty Oasis Hydrating Treatment, so like a moisturizer, which, I mean, is okay. I, I'm, I'm kind of excited about this. The thing is, I do, since I get like the um, beauty fix. I guess I, I, get a lot of, I get a lot of moisturizers is what I'm trying to say, but this will get used. I will use it. I use moisturizer every day. I'll put this in my stash and yes, it will get used. So like I said, I'm kind of excited about this. And then the thing I'm not excited about is, and some people would probably love this, but it's just, I've got so many water bottles. We got this water bottle, this plastic Zingo water bottle. The idea is cute, but I've gotten one before, I think from Pop Sugar. It was bigger than this, and I think it was pink and clear. Uh, you actually would unscrew this part. You could put like your own, infuse your own juice, like from an orange, a lemon, a lime, whatever, into your water. And um, this is like a really kind of nice rubbery feel, so it's, you know, like you're not going to drop it or whatever because it's kind of got a little bit of grip. But I don't know. I mean, I just feel like a water bottle. I mean, I get it. I do get it because summer's coming and stuff like that. But I'm just, I just don't need another water bottle. So I will be swapping this on my subscription addiction. But anyways, that's what came in the Pop Sugar Mini this month. So I don't know, not really exciting. I don't know what I'm expecting. I think I said this last month. I don't know. But something better than that, I think. Anyways, guys, that was all I wanted to come on today, show you what came in my subscription boxes. And thanks so much for watching. I hope everybody is having a great Friday, and I will see you in the next video.